Okay, in this video, we want to find the inverse transform of the function fs is equal to 2s minus 3 divided by s squared minus 2s plus 1. And so, let's get started. Um, the numerator will keep the same. We'll say 2s minus 3, just for now at least, divided by, and now we will factor this out. Um, we can say s minus 1 times s minus 1. And next, we are going to play around with this in order to make it relate to you know, what we have. So if we say 2 parentheses s minus 1, it's just so we can get a, a match of these two, that would mean we would have 2s minus 2. But in our case, we have minus 3. So we, we say minus 1 on the outside. So 2s minus 2 minus 1 is 2s minus 3. And so the next thing we're going to do is kind of separate everything out. If we say 2 times s minus 1 divided by s minus 1 squared minus 1 divided by s minus 1 squared, that's equivalent, right? And so, but by doing this, we can cancel this s minus 1, and we would have 2 divided by s minus 1 minus 1 divided by s minus 1 squared. And so now we focus on this, and we see if there's a match with our table. Um, with practice, we, we would know that it is. So we have 2 divided by s minus 1. Instead, we could say 2 times 1 divided by s minus 1. And that would be a match with this, where a would equal 1. And so we could say that this right here would be 2 times e raised to t, 1 times t. Next, we look at this, 1 divided by s minus 1 squared. And so that's going to be a match with this one right here. So t, um, n, fact, n factorial divided by s minus a raised to n plus 1. And so in our case, n would be 1. And we have 2. So 1 plus 1 is 2. And so we would say t raised to n. We said n was 1. So t times e raised to a t. a we said was 1. So it would be minus, because of this, t times e raised to t. And so this is our final answer. And that's all we need to do.